Yo, what is going on everybody? Enzim here, and today we are back with another episode of Character Changes in the new patch in 5 minutes or less, and today we are going to be looking at Lab Code 21. So this character has terrorized us for very long, and she received nerfs before in the past, but she received some huge nerfs in this new patch that I think will actually stop her from being top 1 in the game, so let's look at them. So the first nerf she received, and potentially the most important one out of all of these, is that they actually permanently reduced her meter gain by 50% no matter what and this means from combos to system mechanics to even key charge and for an example I'm going to do a basic BMB that typically used to build over two bars and you'll see just how drastic that change is And as you can see, she can't even build a bar and a half now, and this is going to really affect her ability to put pressure on you during her offensive sequence, and in my opinion, this is one of the biggest nerfs any character has ever received in the history of this game. So the next two nerfs this character received actually has to deal with both of her spins, her 236H and her 214H. For those of you who don't know, they are now changed to Key Blast property, meaning that if you block them, you can actually reflect in the middle of them. And as you can see, for 2 to 6 h she, she is minus 15 if you reflect in the middle of it. And for 2 one 4 h the anterior spin, she will be minus 8 if you reflect it. This is extremely important because this means that even with assist, and especially by herself, she can't throw this move out and just steal a turn. She has to be very careful and you have a lot more defensive options to work with. Effectively crippling her neutral. Crippling her neutral, so to speak. The next nerf she received actually has to deal with her command grab, the 214S, and they basically changed this so that it does a little less damage, so that again, on top of her meter gain nerf, she will struggle to effectively set up two touches, and that can help kind of alleviate the pressure from her. This isn't too big of a change, but it's important to know. The next change she received is actually pretty small, this is just a quality of life thing, or a rather a debug sort of thing, where her level 3, this one, would behave weirdly if it was making contact with an assist, so they basically went in and changed it so it will consistently hit and act normally. So the last change they made to this character is her assist, her A assist, also behaves just like her spins on point, meaning that it is also considered a key blast. Meaning, if you block this, you can reflect it. And this is, again, the same case as her spins on point. This will help relieve pressure when dealing with her assist. So, all in all, she receives some pretty big nerfs. Not too sure how this will shake her up in the meta, but in my personal opinion, she's no longer the best character in the game. Where she actually stands on the tier list, we don't know. We'll just have to see. Like always, if you guys like this type of content, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know which character you guys want me to do next. Like always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.